opponent in a strange place here. I'm not, I think that I would go with the Beast of Sergeant. I think it's a Beast. With or without the Owl. I, I think I would, I would probably have Beast of Sergeant, Creeper, and Yeah, it looks like he's doing in fact exactly that. Wow, she calls it, and there's nothing that comes down the other side. Life coach, love is called. Well, I mean, that's one of the things that you get against yeah. these demon handlock decks. There aren't that many demons. Yeah, there aren't actually that many, that many threats that can have a void yeah. power. In particular, when, particularly when you're playing a matchup like this, that can be you know, so uh, so clutch uh, in terms of your ability to need yeah. to deal with certain threats. I think that that was totally correct to actually save the owl. That was a very... I mean, saving the owl. Absolutely. But owl 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 doesn't make that call and not ignore just like attack the base and be aggressive. I, I disagree with the holder. I probably would have attacked that first before right. I had happened. I, I, I guess if it wasn't my hand, yeah. So maybe, no, maybe that was actually just, just, just great. Ends up working out fine, but <laughs> Cook is now, uh, he's, oh. get, he's getting more intense by the turn. Yeah, I mean, the, you can coil right now to actually figure out what comes out. If it's a... Well, a heal bot's not a bad card, but you, with the molten in hand, you're not, gonna, you're not about to use that anytime yeah. soon. The gang boss will come out. We got a way of playing it. Ooh, <laughs> No, it looks like we're going to see that uh, Angel Watcher come down with Sunfruit. I like this a lot. I mean, it's going to at least weaken the board from Eloise and allow the Hellfire to do what it does there. So, I kind of like this. Yeah, this is probably going to provoke and provoke. Yeah. Although, I think tapping is perfect. We'll see what happens. Him getting boss? Oh, okay. I was like, oh, like wait, what? <laughs> Very right, clean trade, no matter what happens. And ultimately, the two versus the three, the key portion here is actually is actually a pretty big deal. It's, yeah, it's, it is. Yeah, she likely actually probably want to want to attack in with the uh, with the what's that? Void tank. Void tank. But but I mean, almost any kind of circumstance, Hellfire would be problematic. Mm -hmm. So in the end. Some of it didn't matter because the imps, of course, won't do anything, but the Void Terror, even if it got an optimal trade, would still at best be a 3 3 uh, against the 2 3. So I think um, in this scenario, it's closing with some way consequential, as long as it doesn't happen. So this might provoke a response. Uh, Life Coach is not in a position to Hellfire and then play him. With. No, he's going to be a little short man. He's going to be one, one man. And even then, you might not feel like you get away with not playing the Molten Giant because we're about to just break trade into the Void Terror. You can taunt it afterwards. Is that ever a play or is Hellfire Mentor right now? I mean, the Drake does put up a really big body on the board to use as trading, and you can also combine it with the Molten uh, with Sun Fury. It's a tough position because if you if you attack into the Spider and then Hellfire, you're actually still leaving your opponent with, with free power. Right. Play. You're, exactly. going, you're going down to. 14 from Hellfire alone. Yeah, so you'd be on 11 technically, and possibly less than that. But you're also past the you're also past the mana turn point where uh, he's you, know, you, you can taunt and heal. That's one of the things that you have to always be careful of. Life is Life like playing two games at once. Wait, and uh, Sun Fury. I know. He's, he's, saving, he's saving Sun Fury, I believe, for Molten Giant, which, yeah. which I definitely appreciate. And here. I mean, this could potentially bait out the owl from Eloise. I doubt it will. I, I, I imagine uh, yeah, it, it, it will not. I hope it will not. Oh, Life Coach is not happy. What, what, did, was there a misplay that I missed? I think like he's, he's sort of calculating things, clapping himself, shaking his head. He is the definition of monster. He, his intensity when he plays is incredible. Yeah, I mean. And it's fine because oh, it's not in the room. <laughs> <laughs> he'll just talk in German. Yeah, yeah. She <laughs> and she might just do the uh, the Chinese. Well, uh, they're taking a very long time as a miss turn. Mm -hmm. For very good reason. This is the tournament life online. Oof. And the, the owl does come down to take out the. I'd be afraid of a shadow flame if I did owl this. It would be even yeah, worse. That's, 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 that's fair. That's fair. I mean, hellfire is still a problem. One thing that um, Life Coach does do is if, if Ellie attacks fully into this, he can do Hellfire plays. Right, but because she's actually. She's not. She's she accounting for Hellfire. Yeah, she's accounting for Hellfire. She told me she was a pretty proficient handlock player. I'm just gonna show those right there. Just, uh, she knows when somebody goes on and gets punished. Handlock is actually one of the decks that, that is probably the most important to have familiarity. I 
actually remember my, uh, my very first tournament that I, <laughs> I played in after, uh, after I sort of started playing, uh, where I played against, I believe it was Rhea playing Hamlock. This is back in the last year of standing. He just right. crushed me three games in a row. And he messaged me after, he's like, you haven't played against Hamlock. Ever. Right? Yeah. Like, actually, never. Yeah. <laughs> it's a very surprising day the first time you run into it, but then as soon as you know the gimmicks, it's a little easier to, to predict. I mean, it's, it's, it's so hard. Yeah, it takes, it takes a lot of getting used to just in terms of understanding the various health and mana flash points that are important for the various giant combinations. I think on the other side, too, Hamlock's one of the hardest decks to play in Hearthstone. Yeah.